everyone and welcome back to day five. Remember today we're focusing on our legs and our glutes. So we will be using our resistant band today. If you don't have one, that is okay because you can easily do it without it. And I will have some weights. And if you don't have the weights, remember you can easily use a book. So if you have not already, you already know, stop the video and stretch because stretching is important and you want to do it before and after your workouts. Now I'm going to go ahead and go through some of the workouts that we're doing today. We have fire hydrants, donkey kicks, and seated leg abduction. We have 10. We're going to do those three times. We have hip raises. You're going to do a total of eight of those. We have one legged rows. You're going to do three of those. We have banded squats. You're going to do a total of 15. And we have standing kickbacks. You're going to do a total of eight of those. When it comes to the sets, for the first two, you're going to do them back to back. Then we will rest and come back to do the third set. Remember, we're increasing this stuff. It's going to be a little different from when we first started because we want to see the progress throughout the workout. So go ahead, enjoy this short video before we begin. Get your water, do what you need to do, because when we come back, we're going to begin with fire hydrants. Here's another health tip, number four. When it comes to your wellness, a lot of people forget that your home is a part of that, that and your sanity as well. So take the time to go to our YouTube channel and organize your home. I've literally redid my home. Yeah, I, <laughs> it's horrible, you guys, but it's very therapeutic for me, um, seeing stuff nice and neat. I already have videos of how I redid my closet and I went back and I updated again. I don't know, I may give you guys a video on that. But taking care of your home allows you to focus on everything else that's going on in your life. So if your home is in order, you can focus on working out, you can meal prep, you can do all that other stuff and still be comfortable and won't feel like everything is everywhere. You're going to begin with fire hydrants and you have a total of 10 on each leg. Begin now. That's five. Switch. Next, you will have donkey kicks and you will do a total of 10 as well. You're going to switch into those now. That's five, you have five more on that leg before you switch. You're gonna switch now. Next, you will have seated leg abductions and you will do a total of 10 as well. That is time. Begin the seated leg abductions now. That's five. You have a total of eight hip raises. And you're going to begin those. If you have a dumbbell, go ahead and grab that and you'll put it on your lower abdominal section. If not, you can do it without it. You're going to begin now. That's two. That's four. Keep going. Next, you will have the one-legged row. You will do a total of three on each leg. So you're going to come up. You're going to begin them now. Take your time. This is about focusing on that balance. That's five. 
that's two. One more before you switch legs. That's three. Switch. After this, you have banded squats and you will do a total of 15. Last one. Now you're gonna start the banded squats. Now. That's five. You have 10 more. Don't forget that after this, we will go right into the standing kickbacks. And for those, you have a total of eight on each leg. You're gonna begin those now. That's two. Switch. That is it. Now we're gonna go right back into those fire hydrants. And remember that you have a total of 10 on each leg. That's five. You're gonna switch. That's five. Next, you have those donkey kicks. And remember, you have a total of 10 of those. And you're going to begin those now. Switch. Do 10 more. And then you will go into those seated leg abductions and you have a total of 10 of them. You're gonna come down and begin the next workout. That's five. You have five more, and then you will move right into those hip raises, and you will do a total of eight. Last one. Now you're gonna go right into those hip raises, and remember you have a total of eight. Begin. Four. You have four more, and then you're gonna go right into those one-legged rows, and you have three on each leg. That's time. And you're gonna begin the next workout starting now. You have one more and then you will go into the banded squats for 15. Begin them now. That's 10. 
And then you're gonna finish off with the standing kickbacks before we do our rest. And you will have those for a total of eight. That's time. And you'll start the standing kickbacks now. Switch. When choosing a cleanser, choose something that is very gentle and that will actually work for your skin while not causing harm. That is exactly why you should order our Refreshing Cleanser 2.0. This two ounce bottle is very gentle and contains ingredients such as goat milk, which naturally cleanses your skin, as well as exfoliate that skin. It also contains acacia honey, which is derived purely from the nectar of the black locust tree flower. This helps soothe inflammation and decrease the appearance of scars and blemishes. Our cleanser is ideal for people who has very sensitive skin, as well as skin that is oily or acne prone. That is exactly why we have that Acacia honey in there because it helps soothe everything. If you haven't already, go ahead and place your order at NeshaeExperience.com. Next you have donkey kicks and you have a total of 10 as well. Switch. You're gonna switch legs. After these 10, you will go into the seated leg abductions and you have a total of 10. That's time. You're gonna come down again to the seated position and begin. That is 10. Now you're gonna lay down and you're gonna begin your hip raises and you have a total of eight. Starting now. Last one. Now you're going to go into that one-legged row. You have a total of three on each leg. Remember to take your time. You'll begin now. Switch. One more, and then you will begin with your banded squats, and you'll have a total of 15. You're gonna go right into those banded squats. Now. That's 
five. You have 10 more. After that, you will do the standing kickbacks and you'll finish off with a total of eight. That's time. You're gonna start those standing kickbacks now. Switch legs. And you're done. That is our workout.